Nand Kepengt is a PhD at the Faculty of Arts and Social Sciences. She focuses her research on sociolinguistics in a former mining colony in Belgium. We are here at the Coal Miners Museum in town like Eisden in Belgium Limburg. I investigate the construction of social identities through language practices of former coal miners from this neighborhood. Maastricht University focuses very much on interdisciplinary research and my project also combines social linguistic research and ethnographic. I talk to people, I do interviews, I conduct audio and video recordings. So these former coal miners have developed their own language, which they call Citedoids, and um, they used as an identity construction about belonging to this place. Yeah. It was about developing a we group and an in-group feeling, about having something that only belonged to them. It is only spoken in the city of Eisden, not in other coal mining districts. But there are only about a dozen speakers left, so we are dealing with a moribund language variety. When these people die, Citerats will just disappear. So Citerats is really a culture heritage. Many of the mine workers came from European countries such as Hungary, Italy, Poland, Austria. And they came to live here in the 1930s and 1940s. There are lots of prejudices at that time against coal mining um, that was also reinforced by the Catholic Church, even though many of the coal miners were Catholic. Yeah. The people who worked in the coal mine lived in a completely different district in the town Wyk. So there was the district on the one hand and the town of Eis on the other hand. When those children at the time um, walked by, the people in the village would close their doors and windows. And that created also a feeling of isolation. Migration is uh, also at the moment an important um, issue. By investigating um, the identity construction of these former coal miners, we will hopefully come to understand how newcomers in our society deal with these multiple and changing identities and what we can do in order to integrate them.